and the Bielefeld attacker screams with pain. Lienen has a 10-inch wound on his thigh, with his bone exposed. Lienen sees Bremen manager Otto Rehagel as the instigator of the foul. Twenty minutes into the game, Ewart Lienen is fouled by Norbert Siegmund. The Bremen defender is booked and the Bielefeld attacker screams with pain. In no way am I saying that he wanted this type of foul to happen. But I do think that everyone who saw the incident close up can confirm that he was encouraged to be more aggressive with this foul. His gesture was unmistakable, and what he said was equally clear. In that sense, I cannot help but blame the Werder Bremen manager. The affair has been ended. The incident is over. If you are involved in this kind of job, you have to be aware that you will sustain injuries like this. With thousands or millions of tackles, one will turn out as badly as this one. Mr. Ray Hagel never gave me a signal. The foul happened in the first 20 minutes of the game and during that time I had no contact with him. You've always been free of guilt. I have always said that and it was confirmed in court. Four weeks after the injury, Ewart Lienen was back on the pitch. In the return fixture in the Bielefeld Arm Stadium, there was obvious tension. Otto Rehagel is only able to do his job as manager whilst wearing a bulletproof vest and under police protection. And 20 minutes into the game, Ewart Lienen is fouled by Norbert Siegmund. A number of defenders don't just want to play the ball. Some of them enter into a challenge knowing that the risk of injuring their opponent is high and try to get a sporting advantage through unfair play. Jetzt nach mehr als 31 Jahren und es war gut. Es war Heilung, wirklich Heilung, es war wunderbar. Ja, also sechs Stunden haben wir geredet und ich hatte das Gefühl, als wären wir immer befreundet. 